when i was talking about paleolithic age manchiga vinandi paleolithic age sea levels are low sea levels were low compared to the present times that boy was asking me was there rama setu at that time ingane nenu cheppalra vaadike ardhamaina rama setu is a bridge that is believed to have been constructed by ram uh, the in the ramayana connecting india to sri lanka to get back his wife from lanka వాడిని అడిగితే నేను ఏం చెప్పాలి రామ సేతు అప్పుడు ఉందా లేదా అంటే వానికి ఐడియానే గ్రేట్ అసలు ఐడియా అది నేను పేలులితిక్ టైమ్స్ ఐమ్ టాకింగ్ అబౌట్ పేలులితిక్ టైమ్స్ అండ్ దట్ బాయ్ ఇస్ ఆస్కింగ్ మీ వర్ దర్ రామ సేతు అట్ దట్ టైమ్ యాజ్ అ టీచర్ డోంట్ యూ థింక్ ఐఎమ్ ఇన్ అ వెరీ ఫిక్స్డ్ డిఫికల్ట్ కండిషన్స్ నెక్స్ట్ నా సో యుల్ సీ హూ స్టార్టెడ్ అ సిస్టమాటిక్ స్టడీ ఆఫ్ ఇండియన్ హిస్టరీ బ్రిటిష్ స్కాలర్స్ వై నాట్ ఇండియన్స్ లేజీ పీపుల్ lazy rabab even today how much of history you have studied about your country from childhood you know we don't have any interest ungar jepta chudan suppose tomorrow upsc comes out with a notification saying that indian history has been deleted from the syllabus evar raad class ki kyun you are not here out of any great interest to study my country's history you are here only because it's a part of your syllabus yes or no yes or no frankly japan do you think i studied indian history out of interest for history no i was also upsc aspirant like you people i also studied indian history only because it was there in syllabus ah adi mana talent adi yes please and when we were not interested in our own history we gave chance for chapale outsiders to come and study your indian history when an outsider is studying your history will there be some distortions in that history yes or no koi bahari aadmi aake aapka itihas pad raha hai history pad raha hai to will there be distortions or no please and that's where we are going to into the controversies then next line ask one okay first listen now they have to study indian history they decided to study indian history if they study indian history will they get some benefits political benefits they can rule easy india more easily because they will understand our thinking pattern will they also get a religious benefit that slowly they can facilitate conversions of indians into christianity and asi okay now because they have to study indian history problem is india is not a small country inta peda undi country kaise padoge history will you study history of entire country in one go or will it be better to divide the country into different halves central northern eastern western southern branch yes or no and now what the british used to do na na british people sitting in britain europe lo they used to send some scholars some of them scholars used to come to west india some of them will be sent to are you able to see this different scholars are sent to these areas you will tell me based on your understanding of the first class of our uh, uh, ancient india how does a historian of a modern time understand what happened in the past scripts and they first they have to find out some written text from the past when i get that text i have to first understand the script decode that script and then understand what has been written in those and then i'll slowly start understanding what happened in the past that is one way of studying past but through the scripts there is another way of studying the past through material remains what you call as archaeology and archaeologists okay now right now what is the heading of this main thing right? systematic study of indian history i am not including archaeology over here so these people were collecting all the different scholars nana who they are being sending to, uh, being sent to india each scholar in his particular area is going to find out ancient texts they are collecting ancient inscriptions they are collecting ancient coins etc etc and they are not only collecting but putting them in some museums they are putting them in some libraries and they will sit and write the descriptions of all these things they have found in these texts and inscriptions who wrote that text when did he write that text what is there inside that text what could be the purpose in writing that text who gave these coins what are these coins made of are you able to see this now imagine one scholar in one part of india he is collecting all these things can i say all the scholars in other parts are also doing the same thing and all these people each scholar he is writing some points about all the collections he or she has made and keeping it as a uh, they are accumulating all that knowledge one generation of scholars go away another generation of scholars will come they will also collect more ancient records ancient inscriptions and coins and all 
over a period of time over 50 60 years or nearly 100 years don't you think a lot of knowledge about india has been generated in different parts now is it possible that you will try to put all these texts inscriptions and coins if you analyze them properly can you put them in a chronological order which came earlier which came later 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 this is how and can you reconstruct entire history of india now ardhamaina did you understand how the british systematically work to find out chapalandi indian history ante what events happened when where and why and they have presented all these events in a chronological order now this much we indians could not do uh, these people had to come and do this for us and they did it in a very scientific manner a systematic way lo and for this they created a body called the body's name is asiatic society of bengal that's body nothing but a group of scholars who are experts in collecting analyzing and uh, presenting them in a chronological order that's chapana hmm they were learning all these languages we bolte interest antaru by is asking what is friend are asking all these uh, texts were in different languages no in tamil nadu tamil untada in uh, karnataka kannada ikkad telugu there will be in north india sanskrit hindi so many now these people had so much interest who the britishers they say different scholars were learning different languages na na there were many scholars who were actually learning main language is this one which they were learning na na telugu has a lot of sanskrit words also we do not know much but many of telugu words kannada words tamil words are derived from sanskrit only if you understand sanskrit first will it make it easy for you to understand all other languages of india so these people were focusing more on sanskrit although there were some scholars at a regional level they were also focusing on studying other indian languages also and we must appreciate the british for the energy and motivation these people have shown to do all these things okay so it is one body of scholars in this uh, organization called asiatic society of bengal from here different parts they will go collect all these things and analyze present them and in a chronological order that is how i and you are able to know what happened in india in the past if british people would not have come do you think i will be able to know about ivc and all these things no i did not go and do that research then who did all these things these people right now for this purpose for this purpose comma they established the asiatic society of bengal for this purpose they established the asiatic society of bengal why bengal na first area where they captured india was bengal okay asiatic society of bengal right in the brackets the year of its establishment is 1784 and the person who established is william jones william jones bracket close comma which consisted of which consisted of understand and write which consisted of a body of scholars which consisted of a body of scholars jada thand lag raha hai thand lag raha hai na chale sunda meeke ye pochu na kai sundi chal rahe hain which consisted of a body of scholars whose task whose task was to collect whose task was to collect ancient texts inscriptions and coins ancient texts inscriptions and coins from different parts of india pehle collect karna hai then you will analyze them okay collect all these things from different parts of india comma and and analyze them collect and analyze them in order to in order to reconstruct in order to reconstruct indian history indian history 
in order to reconstruct Indian history in a chronological order. 